Imagine you are given a bag of food items and asked to put them in logical categories. What criteria would you use to organize these items? Maybe you would start by putting items with the same ingredients together. But with this scheme, you would end up with a bunch of extra items that have nothing in common except the color green. You could organize everything by color, but you decide to start over instead. You consider other organizational schemes, such as classifying the items by type of food, such as fruits, vegetables, and nuts. Classifying the items by type of packaging. Classifying by how much each item needs to be prepared before it's ready to eat. Or classifying by perishability. How might your categorization scheme depend on the context? For example, would an artist organize the items differently than a grocery store owner? Let's look at a different group of items. Which of the items to the right is not like the others? If you want a sweet snack, you might put the raspberries, banana, orange, and grapes in the same category. But a botanist, a scientist who studies plants, would categorize these items differently. Botanically speaking, the raspberries are not like the other items because they are aggregate fruits, not berries. Every other item to the right is a berry, but the raspberries aren't. Does this mean you're wrong if your frame of reference is different? Maybe if you're in a botany class, but not necessarily. Categories can be useful for organizing and understanding the world, but depending on the circumstances, there may be lots of valid ways to classify things.